Well, what's up everybody? I hope you're all doing great. Uh, in the next few minutes, we'll do a quick price prediction and price analysis on uh, the render token, abbreviation RNDR. Uh, it was recently listed on Binance or uh, recently, a couple of weeks ago. Um, so yeah, it's actually an interesting project, but this video will be more of a price analysis, so more of a technical analysis. If you do want to check it out, check out their website, rendertoken.com. Uh, or a little bit about it on CoinMarketCap. It's basically uh, distribute, distributed uh, processing power, GPU processing power. Uh, so rendering, uh, that's where the name comes from. So, but as I said, if you wanna know more about it, I've actually not done uh, crazy research on it. So yeah, um, why I'm doing this is because render token is actually looking very bullish. Uh, as you can see here, it found resistance at the 4.88, 5.0 uh, key level, uh, which is pretty strong and it found resistance, but now it actually uh, broke through. So in my opinion, we're still quite bullish, um, at least up until 6.0. So I think either we will see a break retest off of uh, 5.0 or uh, 4.85. Uh, or we'll just go up from where we are uh, right now. We already saw a small retest here, as you can see with the wick. Uh, but in my opinion, yeah, the, the next we might find some resistance at 5.6, but ultimately I think we're going up to 6.0. Uh, and from that 6.0 level, um, basically two, two things are possible. Uh, one is, is that we retrace. So if we find a lot of resistance from it, so if something like this happens, uh, yeah, let me do that more clearly. So as I said, we might see a break retest, maybe some uh, resistance right there. Maybe we'll do something like this. So if we find a lot of resistance, probably at the trend line um, and something like this happens, uh, we might go up again, but eventually I think we're dropping down to at least 5.85 again. Uh, from that 5.85, if we either have a nice bullish move, we'll probably go up to 6.0 and take a break retest off of that again, because that's quite bullish. But in my opinion, there's also uh, the good opportunity that from 6.0, we drop all the way down to 4.0 again. But as I said, that depends on certain factors I just, I just noted down. Uh, another thing that can happen is that it actually breaks. So if it breaks, I think it will probably go up to 6.47, something like that. So that's 8% above um, above 6.0. Is that is that right? Actually, no, 6%. So only 6% above it, which is uh, the candle needs to close above 6.0. It probably goes to 6.45. Uh, and from there, I actually think we're quite able to take a break retest either of uh, 6.0, but that might also be somewhere like 5.88. That's also possible. So something like um, something like that. Uh, and if that happens, to be honest, my my I mean, I dragged it up until here because I think we'll find resistance at the 7.0, 6.85 level. Uh, but to be honest, that's very bullish. So in my opinion, then it would actually go up to 7.5 ultimately. But as I said, that really depends on a few things. Um, I think this is possible. I mean, I, I used to be kind of bearish on the crypto market or not bearish, but at least consolidated uh, on it. But if you look at it right now, it's actually quite bullish. Um, so yeah, a lot of cryptos going up, not a lot going down. And the ones that are going down actually had massive bull runs this week. Um, near, I don't, wow, near protocol went up 50%. But yeah, it's, it's actually looking quite bullish. So if you just wanted to know the price prediction on render, uh, you can go ahead and leave right now. I'm just going to uh, show you the Bitcoin chart real quick to show you that it's actually quite bullish. So what usually happens is that, is that the price drops down uh, and that we have a fake bull move and that from there we would have actually dropped down if, if, if this were, were the bear market. But now we actually th took a break retest off of this. That's actually quite healthy. Uh, in my opinion, we're actually going up to uh, 54,000 again. So obviously it first needs to break, break through this uh, resistance level, but still. So that's just uh, the overall crypto market I'm actually bullish on. And that's why I also think render token can do such an uptrend. So uh, that's basically my analysis on this. As always, this is not financial advice in any type of way. It's just my opinion based on technical analysis. Um, and if, have, if you have any questions about the analysis, please let me know down in the comments and I'll make sure to respond to that as soon as possible. Um, and as for now, thank you all for watching and listening, and I hope to see you all in my next videos. Bye.